Expression is language. It's how we share, touch, eye contact, gesture. Communication, it's more than hearing and speaking. It's what brings us together, what connects us. And when we connect to people, we are living life. You can never test the hearing too early. So babies can be born, they can have their hearing screened, we can do a full hearing assessment day one of birth. In the world of um, hearing loss, early intervention is key because the goal is we want these children to be caught up by the time they enter school. We are here to help inform you, we are here to give you information, we are here to support you, um, and we're here to let you try to see if you can improve your communication. Fix your ear. I had a perfectly normal pregnancy and you know the regular ups and downs. There's nothing in our family history of any hearing loss. So when Lila was born, they said definitively that Lila had uh, profound hearing loss. Ava was diagnosed with hearing loss when she was close to two years old. The condition that she was diagnosed with is called enlarged vestibular aqueduct syndrome. So it was a progressive type hearing loss. So she wasn't born deaf, it just happened over a two year period of time. When Cameron was born, we didn't even have time to really know he had a hearing loss. Yay! Good job! I remember just someone coming up and say, hey, we're here now, do a hearing test. I'm like, you know, okay. Didn't expect nothing like you would. And um, based on that, he, he deferred, which he didn't have normal hearing, so we went for further testing right when he was just a couple days old early stages, a child doesn't realize what they're missing. So they don't know what sound they should be hearing. Even though she was only, you know, two months old, Paula worked to help Lila understand or recognize what was important to hear and what was more in the background. We speak how we hear, so if you have a child that has a hearing loss and they don't have good input, then their speech can be affected. Um, and of course, by having hearing technology, hearing aids or cochlear implants, they get better input and then they need practice to kind of build their speech skills as well. <laughs> Cameron also is on the autism spectrum. Now Cameron's in a place where he's focused enough that you can actually work with him. Whereas if we never got all the services that we had avail of, he wouldn't be where he is right now. We had to teach Ava how to listen and they taught us how to do that. They explained to us to repeat ourselves, you know, explain that, you know, this is an orange or this is the doorbell or this is a dog barking or this is a bird chirping. She didn't know what any of that was. His hearing is actually mild to moderate, so he can still hear and he can still talk. So it would have been years later before we would have known and his speech would have been more impacted and that kind of way too, right? So it's huge for the screening to be done at that time. Everybody wants a normal life for their child. So for somebody to look at you and say, your child is deaf, not knowing what the next step was going to be, not knowing if she was ever going to be able to hear, for me, I would never have survived it without that. Your role as a parent is huge. Um, we can only provide the devices and the advice and instruction on how to use them, but there's a lot of homework that goes into it. Um, really take on your role to learn as much as you can from us and from other families. The relationship that they've developed is so strong that Lila benefits even more from her, uh, from those therapy sessions, not just because of the material that she's learning, but because of the relationship that she's built with her therapist. Good job. My thumb. The guidance and the support that we start out right from the beginning, giving to parents, it's, it's to give the parents the skills so that they can take it home and make the change in their child's life. Own your role as a parent because what you do is going to impact how the child does as well. So you can rely on us, but we're going to rely on you as well.